Hi, kids, and welcome back to Nina Ready Eats. I am super excited. I am trying a new restaurant, and it's called, what is it called? There, it's called Brick Store. I am so excited. I came here last night with some friends, and I was able to have um, a taste of their menu. Now, here I have pork belly with toast, pickles, and I believe this is red onion, and a house chopped salad with a sparkling water quick prayer we're gonna get right into this i'm gonna be expanding the way i do my eating shows you guys so i hope you guys like the new way that i'm gonna be filming them i still haven't incorporated those changes yet but i am working on different techniques Amen. It's the first time trying this salad, so let's give it a go. Eating healthy, y'all. Let's do it. Mm. I love salad. Mm. I'm like so excited to be eating at a new restaurant. When I came here last night, every single chair was full so i was like maybe i'll come really early see if they're um not so busy and i can do an eating show and they were kind enough to turn the music down that was so cool mm. we have apples cucumbers peppers tomato I guess, no red pepper walnuts green apple red onion Mixed greens. Mm. Have you guys ever had pork belly? Take a look at that. Is that not beautiful? First impression, I've never tasted this before. Do I just bite into it or bite? What do I do? Well, it's already falling apart. That's a good sign. That's a good sign, guys. Mmm. No way. Why do I love that so much? Oh my God. What? Why do I love that so much? <gasps> it is so good. Look how it just comes off the bone. Are you serious? Mmm. That fattiness is so good. What? Wait. So there's no bone in this? <gasps> that is simply wonderful. Oh my gosh. I love trying new places. Mm. How? How is that so good? I'm so confused right now. The pork belly is super soft. The outside is crunchy. They must have took hours to cook that. There's no way. That that is not a fast cook. That was a very slow cook. Mm. I'm so excited about this. Salad, you're great, but this pork belly, don't get jealous. This pork belly is doing it, okay, honey? What is going on? Oh my gosh. That is ridiculously delicious. If you come to this restaurant, you got to try this. She said it's an appetizer. This is a hell of an appetizer. Oh, my gosh. What a pleasant delight this is. And the sauce is kind of tangy. It's interesting. It's kind of tangy, sweet, and spicy, but not hot spicy, but hot spicy. 
but not like <laughs> hot spicy. Does that make sense? <coughs> that spice just went down my throat. <coughs> That's me and my excitement. Let me try this pickle. What? How did it? What is this? Is this pickled pickles? Mmm. I feel like, ooh, that is sour, but good. I feel like I've stepped back in time to like the medieval days. Oh my gosh, they say food travels time. This is so true. I mean, obviously they made this in like 2024, but I wonder if any of these techniques come from like back in that era. Mm. Why does all of that make sense? I love the culinary world. I'm such a foodie. I'm supposed to be traveling the world, eating all kind of different foods. <laughs> That's next. Mm. Let's do it. I'm about to live my best life. Oh yeah. Why am I so cheesy and happy right now? This is why I love coming to new places. Mm-hmm. This is amazing. Shout out to this restaurant for sure. If you're ever in the Decatur, Georgia area, please come here. I'm gonna put the address, the phone number, the Yelp, everything will be in the description box. This is not a sponsored meal. I am a paid client, by the way. That's just simply wonderful. Mm. And the toast is buttery. <laughs> it's perfect. What is going on right now? Oh my God, I gotta invite somebody here just so they could try this. I feel like I'm being so selfish. I should have brought Patrick or King Emperor to eat this. Well, oh no, wait, mm -mm. Patrick doesn't eat pork. He don't eat pork or beef. Mm. They nailed that pork belly. This has to be one of the number one selling dishes here. I should have asked her. I was going to get a pot pie, but she said they don't do that till after 5 o'clock. And it's actually very early on. Today it's like, well, it's like lunchtime. Like 12 o'clock. I got lucky. Oh my gosh. And it's like I can't eat too much because I literally have an eating arrangement after this. I'm actually going to be shooting another eating show scene for something else. And I'm like, am I really gonna have to order food? Maybe I'll just get like a drink or something because I am definitely taking this with me. There's no way I'm not gonna finish this. It was so good. I'm like loving it, but then I'm like, should I just finish it? And then what am I gonna do about the other meal? Mm. This is 100% pleasant. Absolutely. You know, salad is salad, right? You kind of know the veggies and the fruit you're eating. Pork belly, scallion, sesame seed on top. 
that barbecue sauce, toasted buttery bread with pickled pickles or pickled cucumber and pickled onions. Perfect. Beautifully done. And I mean beautifully done. Well, what an amazing treat. Amazing treat. I feel very, oh my God, I feel like I'm about to take a bite of this pork belly again. That's how I'm feeling. Like, one more bite, then I'm like, no, take it with you. Ah, what do I do? I'm going to take it with me. Be patient, you know. Be patient. They will be there. When am I going to eat this? We'll be there in a few hours. Because I definitely, I definitely want to eat it. Oh, my God, I want to eat it right now. That's why you can't have eating arrangements back to back. Because this happens. And then I thought I got a small salad. Clearly I didn't. <laughs> oh my God. I love traveling. I love trying new places. I love eating with you all. What can I say? I love it. Damn, I'm like, you can have those. Oh, I am going to have another bite of this. Darn it. I have no discipline. Don't do it. Just one more bite. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Wow. That is amazing. Well, the buttery bread is going to get soggy, right? I might as well eat it now. Mm. Beautiful. You gotta stay positive, stay strong, try a new restaurant, try some new foods, a new cuisine, open up your taste buds, your eating palate, make sure that you enjoy life to the fullest. We literally only have one life to live. Do not allow one situation to hold you back from reaching your dreams or from doing the things that make you most happy. If you're not harming anybody, that includes yourself, be kind to yourself, if you're not harming yourself, if you're not harming the people around you, make sure that you are living your happiest life. Remember, you don't want tomorrow to come around with a sad yesterday, okay? So try to have happy day, happy day, happy day. Sad days will come, but try to have more happy days than none. Until next time, stay positive and stay strong. Bye, guys. <laughs>